guys, welcome to my channel. Um, today I'm going to be reviewing a product for my son here, Ronan. And if you follow our vlogs, then you may have already seen it. It's called the Ergo Pouch. But if you are new, then welcome and consider subscribing. I'm just going to let him kind of play in the background. So hopefully he will not be too noisy. But here is the product. It is the Ergo Pouch. It is the winter sleep suit bag in the color mint. So this is like one of my favorite colors. They have a lot of different colors, navy, pink like kind of creams. They're all very pretty patterns and really trendy colors, so I like that. Um, but if you were wondering what it is, it kind of says in the title, but I got it for him to wear over his pajamas for when he's sleeping, like a suit, so that he doesn't have to wear a blanket, because Ronan does not wear blankets very well. It kind of gets tangled up in them and just kicks them off. And I live in Maine, which is in the U.S., and it's quite cold. Like, it was below 30 degrees last night, so definitely super chilly so if he's wearing an outfit like this okay he doesn't want me to hold him <laughs> then uh he would be freezing so you may have seen in the vlogs that i tried ordering amazon just fleece pajamas in a larger size to put over his thin pajamas and that did not work out so i contacted this company it's an australian based company they have won a lot of awards for these they've been australia's most popular sleep bag for two years running so i was super excited to get it in the mail because i knew it was very good quality and it is organic cotton, so it's like very breathable, very natural fibers, which is important to me. They have swaddles, they have sleep bags, they have sleep suits, which is what I got, and they have ergo arms, which is kind of like a little jacket that you can put over just the top of their arms if they're cold at night. One I got is long sleeve, because again, it's very cold here. I got it in 3.5 TOG, which is like a TOG is a higher level of warmth, so they have different TOGs like 0.5 would be a very thin yeah. TOG, so you maybe would have that for like summer sleepers. And they also have short sleeves, yeah. they have like so many different options. So the sleeves on this one do roll over, you can make a little mittens for extra warmth, but Ronan he would not like that I know because he's like such a picky sleeper. And the first night that I used this I will say I was worried because he was tossing and turning and just like he would not stay asleep so I thought maybe he just didn't like the constriction of not being able to like move around as much as when his legs are free but then I realized he's teething. So the next night I gave him a little bit of medicine before we went to bed and the last like four nights he slept amazingly in it which has comforted me and made me be able to sleep easier because I know that he's warm but not too warm because I checked him and he's not sweaty and they have a nice little like measuring system. Oh I should have found the packaging. Oh hold on. I am back. They actually have this stuff on the website but they sent like a little cute cardboard thing which I thought was awesome and it actually has a temperature reader so it is telling me right now that I need the warm pouch but it'll tell you if it's like you need the cool pouch or the mild pouch because it's warmer where you are and then on the back of here it'll tell you how to dress them under the suit so obviously if you're having a mild pouch and you're using it in the summer you might just put on a little onesie under it whereas he is going to be cold so I put him in just kind of thin long pajamas he needs like a whole layer instead of just like a small layer because it's cold in Maine isn't it? you can have that now run along but yeah, the website is super simple and very easy to understand, very straightforward, which I really enjoyed. Now I just want to talk a little bit more about the actual product that I chose. And I really wish that I could have found this company when he was still being swaddled because I was really interested when I looked at the swaddles. But I think all the items are between $20 at the lowest and like $75 at the highest. But I think there's only one item that's $75 and it's because it's like made of special materials like bamboo and merino. I don't really know what that is, but it's like high quality stuff. So most of them, I think the one I got might have been like around 60 and I spent like $35 for those sleepers, which were useless to me. So spending $60 on something you're gonna use literally every night is a very good investment. And if you can't tell by now, I'm very happy with this product, so I just wanted to put that out there. Um, the sleeves, this part, very soft and stretchy cotton, as well as the sides, so they have like extra movement. And then this part right here, this cushy part, is more of like the sleeping bag material, so it's a little bit stiffer, a little bit puffier. On the feet, they have little grippies because the photos are really good on the website. They show you kids in the sleep suits, and they show them realistically of what they'll look like. So I was not like thinking when I looked at this that it would fit him. He goes down to like about here and all this leg room is very big because it's 12 months to 36 months and obviously he's in the middle of that. So that's what the photos online looked like. You could tell the kids had like a lot of extra leg room and stuff so I really appreciate that because 
it's really horrible when you see a product online, it looks one way and you get it, and it just does not fit your kit the way you expected. So I knew how it was going to fit and I'm very pleased with that. Then of course it's got this little strap here, it zips in the front all the way down. And voila, this is the most important, coolest feature that I'm really happy about. So right now I have it in the sleep suit way, so there's legs here, but there's zippers here. And if I unzip them, la 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 la, and instead of zipping these together to make legs, you can zip them to each other the other way, if that makes sense, like this. Yeah. I'll do it so you can see. He's like babbling to himself in the background, but yeah, it's super easy. So there we go. It's zipped now on both sides. So now it is a sleep sack, like it's an actual sleeping bag. So it's got a four-way zipper configuration, which I've never seen on anything else before, and I was just like... I'm so in love. So I was really scared that it wouldn't work out and it has worked beautifully for us. It makes mama so much happier. I feel so much better knowing that he's warm and that he's not getting tangled in like dangerous blankets or that he's not in any blankets and he's freezing. I do think maybe I should open it up and put him in it. I usually like give him a bottle, change his diaper, and then I put him in it while he's holding on to his bottle so that he's like not thinking about it and then I just kind of pick him up, bring him upstairs and rock him and put him to sleep. But obviously right now he's kind of running around so we'll see how this goes. Yeah. I'm gonna bribe you with snacks. Arms up. Since he's on the smaller side, between 12 to 36 months, I do roll the sleeves once. Zip, zip, zip. You're like a little mermaid boy. Do you love it? Hmm? Oh, are you getting sleepy? Maybe because you're wearing your sleep suit. But yeah, anyways, I would give this a big thumbs up. So I will link it down below if you guys want to check it out or any of the other styles that they have. And I think when you first sign up, you get 10% off your first purchase. So. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it informative. If you're looking for a sleep sack or if you're looking to give a gift to like a mom to be or something, I would have loved the swaddles like so much. They're so nice. We will see you guys in our next vlog or review. <laughs> bye guys. Bye 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 bye. Today I'm going to be reviewing. Yeah.